Just a real quick one for those who missed it or need the recap. Bottom of the seventh, and we're down two runs. The pitcher hangs a curveball, we coming on done. It's a three-run dinger, and it put us in the lead. First, I'll clue you in on the history, you see. 2015 in the ALDS. Bautista blast the homer, but it's what happens next. Like a cocky summer gun, he couldn't help but flex. Went and flipped the bat, the tempers couldn't suppress. He thinking he the man, yeah, he think he a stud. The words of Taylor Swift, baby, now we got bad blood. Staring down the pitcher like he got some set. You don't worry, Mr. Dyson, he will get his day. That homer sealed the series, save will go on a clinch. Rangers wouldn't let that happen without clearing the bench. Started getting testy, only words got exchanged. Bautista thought he's tough, that dude must be deranged. Looking like a hothead, he talking to smack. Easy feeling like a thug when you stand in the back. Ever since then, you almost could guarantee. There will be a Texas and Toronto rivalry. I keep it in mind what we know of the past. We go back to Mr. Desmond and his go ahead blast. He gives a little flip to his bat, it's subtle. Adding fuel to the fire, these teams that don't wanna cuddle. Now Bautista up the bat, it's the top of the eighth. Fastball to the ribs, like he tough, he done turned straight. Could've rusted off like it's part of the game. But that ain't how it works with the egotistical brains. Maybe it's the 97 mile an hour pain. He attempted to intimidate, but only fanned the flame. Looks at everyone like the mood getting stormy. Blue kinda prematurely gives both of the dugouts warning. Colton Jose's hand, Blue walks in the first. Bannister inquires if the warning could be reversed. Blue says, nope, I believe it's on purpose. Banny's like, I right, that's cool, cause I think it was worth it. Two batters later, Batista's still on the base. Rangers about to turn another legally leading double play. Batista slides dirty, couldn't stop being moody. And now he done messed up, cause he messing with Rugi. Rugi like, what up, you're not so bad without your team. Batista says he is, then Rugi makes his face a meme. Boom, everyone starts wailing. Odor with the glove slap? That's a bad Venezuelan. No one's ever been so happy for a hug from Beltre. Empty all the benches, we gon' have us a melee. Kevin Pillar pretends he wants to destroy. But I have a working theory that he's only a decoy. Lurking like a lion in the tall grass, wanting some. Stalking at his prey, hothead Josh Donaldson. And now we found this moment, so we leave from his hiding place. But this time it's the prey that takes the fist to the lion's face. Poor little lion, not only gets cold cocked, but UFC Rugi. He does the Nolan Ryan headline. Who would have thought Rugi punches like Tyson? You know who else wants some member of that boy Dyson? Just wanted some revenge, he's still mad for the flip of the bat. Batista over here still trying to figure out where he at. That you have it intense to say the least, man. A rival reborn, second baseman turned beast, man. They say don't mess with Texas, I suppose that's the slogan. And that's the recap of the most satisfying Rangers win. <laughs>